Hello everyone and dear children, how are you all today? I hope everyone is doing fine. Welcome back. Today, we shall be looking at Unit 2, Smart Kids in your textbook on page 16 and 17 and workbook on page 11. In this lesson, we shall be learning some vocabulary, listen and read about how the children go to school, and also learning the usage of the verb to do, do and does to ask questions with yes and no answers. Let's get started, shall we? First, let's learn some vocabulary. Listen and read after me. One, take the bus. Menaiki bus. Take the bus. Number two, drive. Memandu. Drive. Number three, walk. Berjalan kaki. Walk. Number four, take the train. Menaiki kereta api. Take the train. Number five. Ride a bike. Menunggang basikal. Ride a bike. Take out your textbook and turn to page 16. Let's listen and read together. Activity 1. Listen and read. Hey, Anna, come with us. My dad always drives me to school. Thank you. Do you always take the bus to school, Anna? Yes, I do. My mum doesn't drive. Look, there's Jenny and Billy. They always walk to school. Hey, there's Susie. She always rides her bike to school. Hi, Greg. Now, let's learn how to form questions using the verb to do, do or does with yes and no answers with the singular subjects. First, let's look at the question structure. Begin your question with do or does. For singular subjects, we use does, followed by the subject. Singular subjects, he, she, it. Remember, for singular subjects, he, she, it, we need to use does, followed by the verb in the base form. Example, walk, then the complement. Example, to school and the question mark. Examples of the correct questions. 1. Does he walk to school? 2. Does she walk to school? 3. Does it walk to school? Now, let's see how to answer the questions. Example, question. Does Greg walk to school? To answer the question, for positive answer, start with yes, followed by the subject Greg. Instead of Greg, we can use he, followed by does. Yes, he does. For negative answer, start with no, followed by the subject he, then doesn't. No, he doesn't. Question. Does Greg walk to school? Answer, yes, he does, or no, he doesn't. Now, let's look at how it works with the plural subjects. First, let's look at the question structure. Begin your question with do or does. For plural subjects, we use do, followed by the subject. Plural subjects, we and they. Remember, for plural subjects, 
we and they, we need to use do, followed by the verb in the base form. Example, pack, then the complement. Example, the bus to school, and don't forget the question mark. Examples of the correct questions. One, do we pack the bus to school? Two, do they pack the bus to school? Now, let's see how to answer the question. Example, question, do we take the bus to school? To answer the question, for positive answer, start with yes, followed by the subject, we, and then do. Yes, we do. For negative answer, start with no, followed by the subject, we, and then don't. No, we don't. Question, do we take the bus to school? Answer, yes, we do. Or, no, we don't. Now, let's see how it works with the special subjects. First, let's look at the question structure. Begin your question with do or does. For special subjects, we use do followed by the subject. Special subjects, I and you. Remember, for special subjects, I and you, we can't use does. We need to use do, followed by the verb in the base form. Example, drive, then the complement. Example, to walk, and don't forget the question mark. Now, let's look at the examples of the correct questions. 1. Do I drive to work? 2. Do you drive to work? Now, let's see how do we answer the question. Example, question. Do you drive to work? To answer the question. For positive answer, start with yes, followed by the subject you. Remember, for special subject, we need to change you to I. And then do. Yes, I do. For negative answer, start with no, followed by the subject I. And then don't. No, I don't. Example, question. Do you drive to work? Answer, yes, I do. Or no, I don't. Let's test your knowledge. Complete the questions. Then answer the questions based on the pictures. Lengkapkan soalan. Kemudian jawab soalan berdasarkan gambar. Now, you may pause the video for a while to copy down the exercise and do it in your exercise book. After you have finished, continue to watch the video for the answers at the end of the lesson. Good luck! Hi everyone! Kindly press the like button and subscribe to my channel for more educational videos. And don't forget to share it out. Thank you for your support. Let's check the answers. Are you ready? Number one, first look at the subject, there. Is it singular subject or plural subject? Plural subject, right? So we need to use do, then the verb in the base form, right. Do they ride their bikes to the park? To answer the question, look at the picture. Do they ride their bikes to the park? Yes, right. Yes, followed by the subject, they, then, do, yes, they do. Question, do they ride their bikes to the park? Answer, yes, they do. Number two, first look at the subject, Steve. Is it singular subject or plural subject? Singular subject, right? For singular subject, 
we need to use good does then the verb in the base form take does Steve take the train to work let's check does Steve take the train to work no right no followed by the subject Steve Steve is a boy so we can also use very good he followed by doesn't no he doesn't question does Steve take the train to work answer no he doesn't number three first look at the subject cat is it singular subject or plural subject yes singular subject for singular subject we need to use very good does and the verb in the base form drive does cat drive to the pet shop let's check yes right yes followed by the subject cat instead of cat we can also use very good she and then does yes she does question does cat drive to the pet shop answer yes she does number four first look at the subject you special subject right we need to use very good do and the verb in the base form take do you take the bus to school let's check yes or no no right no followed by the subject you we need to change you to very good i followed by yes good don't no i don't question do you take the bus to school answer no i don't children did you do well in the exercise very good well that's all for today stay safe stay at home see you all again soon bye bye